hey friends welcome to this preview for the second day of quarter finals we have a couple of matches coming up fritz versus musetti and djokovic versus de minor so let's look at the statistics look at the head to head and also look at the key factors in these matches if i talk about fritz versus musetti if i talk about head to head these players haven't played that many matches only three or four matches so it's very difficult to reach a conclusion with this statistic and these three or four matches haven't been one sided they have like split the victories as well so if we look at the head to head it is 2-1 in favor of fritz and the important part is they have met each other at wimbledon a couple of years back and fritz has won that match in straight sets so that gives you an idea of how this match is going to unfold the reason being fritz i think his best chance is at grass because he has a good serve he has power, firepower in his game he has a good forehand and he likes to be aggressive so all of these things these factors play into his hands at wimbledon musetti is a good player he plays well on clay he is improving day by day he has had a good grass season so far so he is getting better but if we have to pick one of these players i think fritz has better skills on resume for grass the key factors i think for fritz we already know it's the first serve and aggressive play as well as he can draw in from the experience that he already has at wimbledon he has played great matches against nadal against djokovic and even his last match against zverev that's what, that was a fantastic one so he knows how to fight back in these matches he knows the surface well and what are the strategy and tactic that he needs to apply so i think he is better suited at the surface and i feel that he has everything going in his favor only fitness is the key so i'm not sure if he is completely fit after so many tough matches let's see musetti on the other hand should focus on holding his serve and wait for an opportunity now he is a good player so he needs to stay on top of his game he needs to be following the scoreboard so if, if it gets to 3 all 4 all 5 all those are the places where fritz might alter and musetti can get chances and he can take risks so he needs to ensure that his end of serve is being held correctly so that uh, the scoreboard pressure can be applied to fritz fritz as we all know has a great serve and he has been serving really well throughout the tournament he had been winning more than 80% of the points in the first few rounds it has changed obviously in the last couple of matches because he had quality opponents to play better opponents to play but still i think his first serve is the key the prediction is that fritz should win this match in 3 or 4 sets now let's go to the other match which is djokovic versus de minor now these players have a lot of history between them in australia we know djokovic played an amazing match and almost thrashed de minor in straight sets a couple of years back at the australian open now the head to head is again it's inconclusive it's two is it's two is to one in favor of djokovic but only three matches and this year de minor has won a match and djokovic has won a match so it's one all and they have never met on grass so it's going to be a new territory for both of them against each other djokovic i don't need any introduction i think he has everything going in his favor the only thing that he should be concerned about is his fitness in the last match also we saw him struggle a little bit he did not say anything in the press conference but i don't know if he is completely fit or not plus he is coming back from a knee surgery so it remains to be seen if he can carry on at a good level throughout this tournament so that is the only factor that he should be concerned about otherwise game wise i think he has all the shots he knows how to play on grass he can be aggressive and de minor is actually a good match up for him if you see the other matches de minor plays much like leighton hewitt or andy murray and those sort of players match well against djokovic for djokovic because he likes to play from the baseline and he just has that extra gear which he can rely on and beat these players so unless de minor produces an absolute beauty his best day in tennis i think djokovic has too many things to in his favor to win this match the key factors as i mentioned djokovic is fitness de minor needs to take risks 
and let's not forget that he too had health issues in the last match so it remains to be seen how he is feeling but he if he is feeling well i think he needs to take more risks and take the game on to djokovic if he gets uh, engaged into rallies i think djokovic is going to come on top and uh, he's going to win prediction as you might know djokovic should win this comfortably in three or four sets so that is the analysis guys thanks for watching